What's going on YouTube? Thomas coming at you with a brand new video guys and in today's video we're going to be talking about how to make landing pages in GetResponse so you don't have to essentially go out and buy a email software and a landing page builder like ClickFunnels or something like that. So that's kind of like a two-in-one. I'm going to show you guys a little trick that I kind of been testing out uh, in my free trial. So actually I do have a, I just got a quick free trial of GetResponse just testing it out to see how it works. Um, it's You get 30 days free when you sign up completely free. I don't think you even have to enter your um, your credit card information or anything like that in there. So uh, pretty much it's guys, it's great. If you guys have, you know, want to just check, check it out, test it out, give yourself 30 days to kind of see what you can do with it. It's a great option. So uh, link is in the description if you guys actually want to check it out for your 30 day free trial. So what I actually want to do here, guys, is you can obviously it's an email software, so you can do email marketing. You can create emails on demand right now. I can go make one, send one out, and I'm going to have future videos on how I would recommend doing that, how you want to sell, how you want to provide value in your emails um, to essentially maximize your list. Um, you can obviously do automations where you can set these emails in advance and once someone joins your list they're automatically sent these emails over the course of a certain amount of time that you select um, and now actually what I'm what I really am curious about here um, I'm not really getting into webinars just yet something that I may want to check out in the future but what I'm curious here is the landing page feature this landing page feature is actually kind of interesting so I've just been kind of messing around with a couple things you can actually only have one landing page live on your free trial which I found out yesterday but I'm gonna click create landing page I'm gonna kind of take you guys through you know how you can build a landing page so that this way if you're on a budget you can essentially pay for your get response after that first month free trial you can pay for your get response I think it's like 15 bucks a month up to like a thousand subscribers really not that bad um, considering others you know softwares out there for what it has um, you pay that and then you essentially get your landing pages you know your basic landing pages um, and you know your email services so what I like to do guys is you can kind of check this out here to see what you want to do um, pretty much if you're going to do uh, let's say affiliate marketing which is most people who are watching this video are probably into in looking into that what you can actually do guys is check out like these different like options they have here so maybe what I would do is a sign up and registration because what you want is you run an ad for example or you know you have traffic driven to a page where someone signs up maybe that you give them a free book a free something um, and then you put them on your list and you can email market to them in the future so what I would do is you know a sign up page maybe check out a sign up template here um, or you can even start from scratch which I I recommend if you want to go super simple but these are actually kind of great because if you can find a category or something similar to what you're doing it's actually great let me scroll down pretty far I think what I saw yesterday um, was kind of interesting yeah so for example this is a perfect template right here it's like you're gonna do like a test I'm just gonna call it a test right for, for example so you can kind of scroll through these and check what you want to check you know go through what you want to check and um, here's what's gonna happen you're gonna have this little guy here as it loads and you should be able to pretty much edit everything on the page so let's see what we got as it loads up here also another thing you guys want to check is this mobile you want to it currently has the editor in uh, desktop but you definitely want to check mobile because a lot of people that you're gonna be driving traffic that the traffic you're gonna be driving to this page are a lot of them are gonna be on mobile so especially you know now and especially going forward more and more people are going mobile so I recommend at least checking that out because sometimes it is different. It, it, the design is not the same exact. So I recommend checking that out and at least making sure it, it looks decent. So guys, this is, this is literally it. This is awesome. So you can have a page like this built for you. And let's say you're driving you know, people to your affiliate marketing funnel, for example, where you're giving away a free book. You're then putting them on your email list and then you're going to market to them in the future going forward. Maybe you throw an upsell in there after they get the free book. Or you say, here's your free book, check your email. But by the way, you know, check out this offer right now. Maybe you give them an upsell right on the front end. So this is really great. It's 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 a great template already set for you. Um, name and email. They must enter the email here as there's a star. They don't have to enter their name. Click sign up and then boom, they take it to a thank you page, which they already kind of have a template here. And you give them some information. Maybe you say, check your email for the free book. Or maybe you give them a download of the free book. Or what you can even do, guys, is I'm going to show you in a second. Um, you can actually send them to a custom thank you page, which I will show you how to do in a second. So let's say you're going through this. 
Um, this looks fine. This picture looks fine. You want to edit some of this text. Uh, you can kind of come in here pretty sim pretty quick and easy and just edit some of this text. Um, let's just say that, for example, put a couple things. Mess around you know, with the colors if you want, all that type of stuff. And let's scroll down here. You get some testimonials. Maybe take some of these testimonials out. You don't have testimonials for the situation. You know, it's understandable if you're just trying to, you know, give away a free product um, or something like that. So you take some of these out. Uh, let's see if we can get some of these guys to go. Yeah, you can just kind of get rid of this, delete that. And, you know, you can kind of go through and delete everything as you want. Maybe you put a picture of yourself here to kind of provide a little more security to the person who is putting their email down. They know it's not going to some random person um, with no name. They at least see your face. Maybe you put a signature here or something like that, a little personal message, something like that. So let's say you go to the next step. After that, um, continue with that mobile versions. Um, let's go return to the editor. Let me show you guys the mobile. So here's the mobile. It's going to take us right to the mobile version. You know, here's what it's going to look like. So it's, it's definitely different. It's a little bit more of a longer kind of setup. So if that's you know it's something you want to take you know into consideration before you just you know let this page go because a lot of people are going to be coming to the mobile version. Maybe you don't like the setup of the, the like and the tweet. Maybe you want to put one here and you want to put one here. So something like that, right? So let's take it over to the next step and let's proceed without mobile for now in this situation. I believe it's going to take us to the thank you page. From what I know, actually no, it's not. We already all right. It's fine. So here's that you can title the page here. You can then put a little mini description here. And what you have to do, guys, here is give it something uh, related to what it is. So if it's a free download, right? Maybe you want to put free um, affiliate book, right? At and he, they give you a couple options. Um, you're required to put these down if you don't have a domain. Of your own, which many people I would imagine who are watching this video don't. If you do, great. You can put it, kind of select your own domain there, add one uh, or whatnot. But I like gr8.com because it's pretty simple. If you want to put subscribe now or get re get response pages.com, I kind of like I looks like a lot. Gr8 is just simple. It's cleaner. I think when someone sees this, that's not going to be as bad. You choose a list. For example, I have I have this on confirmed opt-in. I believe they will actually confirm with um, the person who opts in. Are you sure you want to opt in? I tend to have that off. You can have it on. Depends what you want to do. Um, it's up to you. And then maybe you can add in to the cycle of whatever. So if I had an autoresponder set up for this list, I would add them into day zero, which is essentially right away in my you know, case. And here's what you can actually do. Here's the thank you page situation that I was kind of looking at. Default thank you page. Um, that's the one that you created in the editor previously. You could have them stay on the current page. Don't really recommend that because they're gonna say what what just happened. Like I just entered my stuff and where to go? Like well, I should go somewhere else, right? But what you can do is do a custom thank you page. So maybe what you do is in your editor, in your um, landing page that you have set up, you say something like you're gonna you know ch you will get an email within you know 10 minutes or 15 minutes or within an hour, whatever you want to do with your free gift. In the meantime, you know check out this free video. Subscribe, you know click. The button or submit your information to continue something like that or maybe you want to do something where you are telling people to go straight to a free video a free training video which is your affiliate offer so let me give you guys an example right I'm gonna go over to Clickbank really quick and I was actually just looking at a couple things here yesterday but I know this John Cristani's auto webinar funnel so let me just say I want to promote this for example right I'm gonna click create and okay, well, I don't think I let it load the nickname. Oh, I don't think I'm logged in. Okay, so let's just click this for example, right? John Cristani's auto webinar, right? So here's what happens. It's called the imjetset.com. This is his landing page. I think it's a pretty uh, high ticket product that he is selling here. He does have a lot of great information. He's a great um, affiliate marketer. So maybe what you want to do is send them directly to this page. So you get your affiliate link, for example, let's pretend that this up here was my affiliate link. So let's say we're gonna copy this link at the top here. We're gonna copy that, let's say it's my affiliate link from ClickBank. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna go here and custom URL and we're gonna send the people directly to this page. So maybe you wanna say something like, I am you know, a free, maybe you literally copy this, this text. Free training video, how to earn a seven figure side income online. You literally copy that into your get response page. You then have people opt in to get the free training. So they give them your, they give you their email, 
they get the free training. They go to the free training video. Maybe you also say, in addition, you'll get a free bonus tomorrow of your free book or you know something that you automatically sent in your uh, autoresponder, for example. You give them the free book. You give them a download or something like that, right? In addition to getting this free training, this is now your front end offer. So you collect their email, and then once you collect their email, they come here, they watch this video. It's actually I watch a video. It's pretty cool. Um, I it's, it's people say it's cheesy. I think it's kind of cool. Uh, I think for the average person who sees that, they'll get hyped up. They'll actually kind of like it, and maybe there's a chance that they end up buying you know his program or what he's selling, right? So maybe they do that, right? And it's it's better to give yourself a chance because you don't know who you're gonna get to your um your your page or your landing page so maybe that person does want to actually buy so it's a great idea to have a custom url as your affiliate link and now you have their email once they opt in and boom just like that you guys are pretty much set if you make some front-end commissions great if not you have their email to remarket to them going forward provide them value and then you have them you know maybe you they don't like that product maybe they want something similar but not you know that expensive right you always have that option so guys that is kind of a little side hack or a little hack, like a little hack that I kind of have when it comes to creating landing pages instead of getting, you know, a click funnel software or a lead pages or something like that and an autoresponder like Aweber or GetResponse, you know. I, there are I think there are some that have both, I believe. Um, some services that have both similar to this. But I mean, it's it's a great for 15 bucks a month up to a thousand subscribers. Once you have a thousand subscribers, you should be making money if you know what you're doing. I mean, by that point, you'll be making money with your list, so you'll be able to upgrade and you'll have no problem upgrading. So, guys, that's pretty much it for uh, when it comes to building a landing page through GetResponse. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please consider subscribing to the channel down below. I will really appreciate that if you guys do. And guys, like this video if it was helpful, and I will catch you guys next video. Peace.